let's talk let's talk about let's go down this left hand side let's talk about conversion yeah. right I like this chart Gary mm -hmm. I think it's I think it's quite indicative of what is actually going to happen to your pipeline you know? okay so you know if you're seeing kind of what we're seeing what 40 percent there which is pretty good, I'd say. Yeah. It is pretty good. You're probably looking at 30%, aren't you? In, in most many businesses, businesses yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But if you're looking at 40%, you, you kind of know that you're likely then to turn around 40% of your, your forecast. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, this chart is telling you the, the conversion rate. So it's telling for all of the deals that we won in January, what was the win rate by value and what was the win rate by count? So how many... What, how many deal? What was the percentage win rate by the number of opportunities yep. and by the value of opportunities? Yep. Um, yeah. So I, I just would say that what I have seen that there is a danger that, that you rely on this and you you try to get your percentages up. I, I, yeah. I, I don't think that's best practice here, is it? To, I think it's a chart. You have to you have to use judiciously. Mm. What I mean by that is that I think this is I actually like this chart because it's telling you about your performance. I mean, what happened in November? Our win rate by count was higher than the win rate by amount. We can see that in most other months it was the win. It was the other way around. I think it's a great chart to drill down on yeah. and look at individual salesperson performance and understand win rate over time by salesperson. But here's the warning. The challenge with this chart is that if you overemphasize the importance of conversion rates, what's going to happen? Well, one thing that could happen is people, salespeople are reluctant to put a deal into the pipeline until there's a until they are pretty confident that there is a deal there to be won. Yes, you don't want to look at this as much as you'd like to see it all at 100 percent. That's not going to be an accurate reflection. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I've seen cases where people are, I mean, no business in the, not, not the Lama, where I win 50, 60, 70, 80% of their deals. But I've seen conversion rates showing that. Well, what that's telling me is that when I look at my pipeline here, my pipeline is inaccurate because it's telling me that they are only putting deals into the pipeline, that they're confident there is a deal there to be yes. done. And funnily enough, you get the opposite. Yeah. You get the opposite yeah. happening. Um, we looked at this. Where was it? Here we go. The pipeline by created date. But if I'm overemphasizing the imp uh, overemphasizing the importance of conversion rate, then I've, then as a salesperson, I've got little incentive to close out some of these dormant deals that I just know haven't got legs. So again, it's 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 like a lot of things. You know, there's no one chart dominates. No. Use it in the context of your business.